Now, listen, you sub picked up on something today that uh, actually really uh, caught my interest, and that is its Stand Strong NZ campaign against bullying, because New Zealand has some terrible figures around one and two New Zealand kids feel like they were bullied, and that led me to start thinking about my childhood and the fact that I actually suffered a lot of comments about my looks, starting with a nickname I got called Patty Carrots. That was because I had really bad buck teeth oh, you? when I was young. Um, people would call me Bugsy and things like that. And as I got a bit older, um, I never liked that name, and I don't call it a nickname because it actually hurt me. And as I got older, uh, I suffered from acne, uh, and then my facial features started developing to sort of what they are like now. And the nicknames, or well, the names, actually got a lot worse, and in fact, people would often call me ugly. Uh, then, uh, later in life, I kind of got on with things, and then I got into television, where social media was around, and you know, you do face, um, I sort of try to count it up today, probably thousands of times that people have called me ugly or made negative comments about my looks. And I never really talk about it, and I deflect it, and that kind of thing. Um, but earlier this year, I was talking to some students, some young students, who asked me about that kind of thing and said that they were worried about going into television because of what people would say about them. And off the cuff, I said to them, well, imagine if one of those comments in my life had stopped me from doing what I do now. Mm -hmm. Imagine all of the things that I would have missed out on if I listened to those people. Um, so my message to anyone out there who uh, suffers negative comments about the way that they look is that I refused to let name calling get in the way of my dreams and never let negative talk about the way you look get in the way of yours. There we go. Well nice. said, Patty. Really, Thanks. really well said. And also, perhaps, some people perhaps realise that when they're making what they think is just a throwaway comment or a joke to their mates, that, that there's a real person on the end of it. And I say that as one of the bullies, I think on seven days, yeah. I've used you as a punchline. Yeah. And uh, I'm sorry. It's I, all good, mate. Well, it was all distance for me. It good. wasn't, it was, I didn't know you then. Now that I know you, I'll make way more jokes about you. Yeah. But, <laughs> hey, I apologise. Um, you can find out more about the campaign News Hub uh, on the web and uh, hashtag stay strong NZ.